Oh my god, my baby daddies, I miss you guys so much. Today I'm doing a hair. Get ready with me. Okay, so I had just relaxed my hair, girl. I was feeling some type of way. So, you know, I washed it or whatever after relaxing it, neutralizing it. And I had just cut it too, actually, a couple of weeks ago. So it's pretty blunt right now. I thought I wanted to do like natural hair for a little while. Then I cut it and I was like, nah, I'm just gonna braid this up. So yeah, here I'm just blow drying it, obviously. I'm not using any combs or anything. I just finger comb it because um, obviously I just relaxed it. So I don't want my hair to be ripping out. <laughs> Gotta be gentle. I've been relaxed for as long as I can remember. I keep saying relaxed, but I really mean retouched. Like I just got my roots, you know what I'm saying? My ish was nappy, okay? I don't know how y'all do it because I can barely even deal with my new growth. All right! My God, my God. Now when the hair is all dry, I kind of just pass a comb through it just to make sure there's no little knots or tangles in it. And then I go through and I check to make sure that I don't have any like um, sore spots from the relaxer. And if I do, I put some tea tree oil on it. But I didn't. I did a good job this time. Okay, then I just section everything off, you know what I'm saying, start um, braiding. But before I start braiding, um, I put this coconut oil into my hair. And I sell this coconut oil, so if you guys want it, it'll be on one of my sites soon. Etsy took me down, they said I wasn't vintage enough, so I'm not messing with Etsy no more. But I will get into that in a different video. So pretty much I put coconut oil on the whole section. Then I go ahead and put it on my roots and then start braiding. And then when I get to the ends, I put coconut oil on the tips and then I finish off the braid. You know, I couldn't even teach anybody how to cornrow their own hair. Like, it literally came to me in a dream. It was like, uh, duh, this is how you do it. And I can't teach anybody. So, um, yeah, that's, that's how I learned in a dream. When my hair is freshly relaxed, I'm able to get away with just doing four braids, but as it gets thicker and the new growth comes in, then I have to do like six. But then I just put some elastic bands on the ends, that way that um, the tips of my hair don't rub up against each other and give themselves split ends. Now I go ahead and put a little bit of Eco Styler on my edges and then I go in with the edge control by ORS. I don't even know if it's still by ORS. Oh, who cares? Y'all know what I'm talking about. And I put that on top of it and that just gives me like the perfect slick down, girl. Slick it down, girl. So Ooh, who this? Ooh, edges on flocking to the east. Okay. Anyways, this is a wig grip, and I just put that on so that my edges don't rub against my wig, and it also helps secure the wig down. This hair is from Ali Annabelle, and I just did a review for them. The only issue I had with this hair was shedding, but the hair is beautiful. Now I'm going to go ahead and use my Irresistible Me Diamond Flat Iron and, you know, just do a few passes because this flat iron is so dank, you know what I'm saying? You just got to do a few passes and your hair scrape. All right. Trust him when you give your heart to me. 
big boom Ooh, check out the little edges trying to pick through or whatever you know that's why i like relaxing my hair because my edges be finally be trying to cooperate against this now i'm just like using my irresistible me air on one barrel i don't know which barrel this is but it's the one that's like it gets bigger than i kind of guess like little or something and i'm using that and i'm just getting you know medium sized sections small medium to small size sections and you know just doing what wands do i don't really know how to explain this wands have been around for 112 years so i feel like you should know how to use them by now pero you know i digress or something i digress or something you cannot drag with my love. But she don't do that. That's my love. All in all, you call her ginger. Uh, you remind me of a cute diamond. Girl, I love you. You're too true. Check out my rolling of a cobody. Yeah. Ooh, check out them curls. And I know while doing this video, I looked really stressed. And that's because I was so sick right before I went to Miami. I was stressed, y'all. I was stressed out. And I'm sure it was like 5 o'clock in the morning trying to film some videos. Because, you know, I don't be knowing how to sleep at night. Because I got insomnia. Maybe I don't have insomnia, but I really just don't be sleeping at night, Pero, You know, I don't really even need to be saying all of this, but I just don't know what to put right here, so I'm just gonna talk because I know that I just don't want to talk and I don't want to do something like that. But I don't know how I do that something like that. My neighbors hate me. Boom, y'all. If Pocahontas had electricity, this is what her hair would look like, is all I'm saying. You know what I mean? I'm Pocahontas. Look out for the review on this hair. It is gorgeous. This is the star of the show, obviously, and my irresistible me. Hot tools. Love these. You guys know I'm always raving about these. I'll put the 10% code or $10 or 10% or something like that. I'll put that down below. I don't know if it still works because this is from like two years ago. But yeah, I still love the hot tools with all my heart. I'm going to turn around. My bed is a mess because I'm actually leaving for Miami tomorrow. So, um, I'm packing. But I don't know. I feel like I should stop giving disclaimers because... If my room is dirty, then it's fucking dirty. But it's not dirty, those are clothes. Make sure you go out and do wonderful things in the world. Make sure no drama comes from anybody but me because I'm your baby mama. All the links to contact me and my social medias are down below as well as where you can get this hair as well as where you can get these hot tools. They're all down below, you guys. All the information is down below. And if there's any background music, check down below because sometimes I put it down there too if I know where I got it from. And if it's not down there, then usually I don't know where I got it from. All right, you guys. Give me a kiss. <gasps> Love you, bye-bye.